patients. This is about people who have chronic conditions. And we know absolutely and, uh, that to our founder and director and also MS patients. We have a great deal of evidence now to show that cannabis, raw cannabis, is beneficial against many, many conditions. And we, you know, we need to stop arresting these patients right now. And we don't need to change the law to do it. All the, all the Home Office Minister needs to do is a quick sign of the pen. Uh, and all of a sudden, it's out of Schedule 1 uh, uh, of the Misuse of Drugs Act, which means doctors can talk to patients. I'm a patient myself. Without cannabis, um, I probably wouldn't be able to work. Um, I wouldn't be able to live a normal life. Um, but cannabis gives me the choice to not take medicines that cause me distressing side effects that were really life-changing for me. I've used cannabis to replace all of the drugs that I had to take. I've never, I haven't even taken an ibuprofen in, in about two years now. MPs tend to be cautious on this. They don't want to be accused of encouraging drug use. But I believe the stronger case has come forward now and said that cannabis has a different use as a medicine. And we can't uh, say to people, stop taking that, even if it's the only drug that gives them some dignity and some peace to their lives. It's cruel and it's a great shame uh, that people are being criminalized in this way. Bill has been supported by two Police and crime commissioners who come down here, the Multiple Sclerosis Society, and I believe the, the younger MPs here are seeing uh, that this is the way forward.